My name is Brooke Adams. Growing up, I was taught about God and Jesus dying on the cross to save us from sin. My family went to church on most Sundays. My mom put me in a Awanas club at a young age, doing her best to help me build a strong relationship with God. However, the older I got, the harder it was for her to make me go or want to go to church. I had a few friends at the time that made me question my faith because they didn't believe. I got caught up in sin. I started hanging out with the wrong group of friends, partying, drinking, doing drugs, cheating, lying, and stealing. Shortly after I started straying further away from God, He pulled me back in. At that time, I asked Him to forgive me for my sins and save me. I believed in Him ever since, but I still wasn't living for Him. I would watch church online here and there and go to a service occasionally, but nothing consistent. Moving back to Georgia from North Carolina almost a year ago was the best decision I've ever made. My mom attends church here every week and described how awesome Wamba Land would be for my son and how much my husband and I would love the preaching. Being physically in the church and involved, sitting next to my mom and my husband, singing the gospel songs, and knowing that my son is in a good place in Wamba Land with people that love him and that are teaching us Jesus is just amazing. I'm forever thankful for my mom because if it weren't for her, we wouldn't be here today. I also want to thank my husband for being willing to move to this area so we could experience this community. I also want to thank my son Grayson for making me want to do better and be better. I know that I'm ready to be baptized today because I'm done living for the world and in my sinful ways. I want to be fully committed in my relationship with God. I want to live for Him and through Him. I'm here today to let you know that Jesus Christ is my Lord and Savior and that I'm forever free. Brooke, we are so glad that you chose to move back here. We're so glad that you're a part of going at church. Um, the prayers of a praying parent are on display right now. And we are so grateful that we know you're saying those same prayers for Grayson and he's learning about his heavenly father in, in Wamba Land right now. I, I mean, we've had a lot of discussions um, and I know that you know once you ask Jesus to be your savior, there is nothing that can separate you from his love, nothing on heaven or earth, nothing that you can do or say, you are forever his and he is forever yours. And so today it is my honor and my joy to baptize you, my sister, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit.